Chicken nuggets! <laughs> What's up, stream? <laughs> Spirothon hype! Super hype, dude. Super Can we get some hype. introductions for everybody here? Yeah, I'll go first. I'm SSBM Stuff. They call me Saboom. Hello. Chris LBC. Yep. I am Deo Man 7, also known as Deo. And I am Deo's Correction Bot. <laughs> You're my what? My correctional officer? <laughs> yeah, yeah, what do they yeah. do? They call it something different there in the UK? What did you say, like correction cop or something? Uh, I, I, I just correction bot. I was just oh, like, I'm bot. Just uh, oh, okay, so you're gonna like auto correct. All right, I yeah. he's my carer, okay? He's Dude, you guys gotta do like the alternating thing commentary. Thing. Like, <laughs> <laughs> anyways, he's here to make sure I'm not promoting any like Spyro fan art or anything like that. Okay? Yeah. Oh boy, except if it's mine. Unless it's like Nos. <laughs> By the way, shout outs to Nos the Whelp who makes awesome Spyro fan art. And oh, also Speedo. Yeah, 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 yeah. Big shout outs. Big ups. Yeah, I'm, I'm not really supposed to be here. So, do we got a countdown? Or what's yes. going on? Deo, uh, give them a countdown. All right, Deo. Kick it off, man. Like that. Oh, torch. I get to do the countdown? All right. Are Hell you guys yeah, ready? Dude. Hell yeah. All right. From five. Are you ready? Five, yeah. four, three, two, one, go! go! Hell oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, Spiral One. Ow, ow, ow! <laughs> yeet, dude. Yeah, not to mention yeet. Not to mention. So, oh. do you guys want to say anything about the category before yeah, things no, start getting really underway here? I want to say it's a lot of fun, and I'm happy to be here. That's about all I got. <laughs> That's everything? <laughs> yeah, that, nice. that is. Chris, the... any words of wisdom before you get into it? Find dragons first, that's all I can tell you. <laughs> so yeah, so all while these guys are focusing on their playing, I'll be doing, I guess, the brunt of the talking here so that they can bring you guys the most um, beautiful, pristine, perfectedly optimized Spyro 120% run. Hyped up. So we're heading over to Sunny Flight right now. Hype, 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 this, hype, level, hype. this level is super hype, actually. But it's kind of slow, so we have time to like talk about things. Basically, a little bit of like history with this category is I personally got into it about like five-ish years ago, um, and Chris and Boom have been playing it ever since then as well. So there's a lot of history with us in this game, and yeah, I mean it's just been over this whole time. There's been very few like route changes or overall trick changes for the most part. Um, the run has remained really similar to kind of its. Um, to what it was originally way back in the day just with a, the addition of a few couple like really specific tricks uh which we'll talk about as they uh, hit them but for now we're just flying through sunny fly we're having a good old time you know we're hanging with our buds and uh life is chicken good, nuggets guys. drinking beer i'm eating some chicken nuggets right now <laughs> i'm chilling dude i got my chips so yeah just kick back and get comfy i'm dreaming about chicken nuggets. nuggets you're dreaming about them a that's, man is hungry. That's amazing. <laughs> he's just straight dreaming about chicken nuggets, man. <laughs> he doesn't know if he's like half awake, half asleep right now. <laughs> it's like I chicken think nuggets I have are pretty good. Nuggets. I can definitely confirm that. <laughs> Only the best spiral commentary for you guys. Oh yes. Also, <laughs> I'm wearing Dale Man's jacket. I feel the need to mention this is very important. It's a good luck term. Yeah. He, he is embracing Franco Z. Yeah. But now yeah, that Deo had that. that is that still his avatar? avatar? In case for anyone who like doesn't know, uh, Saboom and I went on a like a four mile long like skateboard slash roller skate expedition through San Jose Hell over yeah. at TwitchCon, and it was like actually scary as heck because like we were going like through the forest of San Jose and like underneath like overpasses. It was and like midnight, I, it was super dark out. It was super dark and dude, things were not looking good. We thought we were actually about to just get lost and just like starve to death, but or we just somehow get attacked back to the by hotel. a homeless person or something. So yeah, plenty, plenty of, of homeless people, you know, staring at <laughs> them. But we made it and we're back here to bring you guys this run today. So Hell yeah. you know, shout outs to being alive. Yes, being alive is pretty decent. Pretty crucial. All right, so you guys can see right here, they're doing some pretty cool jumps. Um, they're gonna do it again right here where they hop down to this ledge 
and then come back with uh, a charge glide to get up. Oh, and you can see them rub the wall right there while they're gliding. We call that a wall glide. It helps us maintain some of the uh, the altitude of our glide because naturally Spyro descends when he's gliding, as most of you know. Here comes another really cool jump right here. Boom! Chris got it. Saboom got it. Man, these guys are neck and neck. This is actually really high. Oh, okay, yeah. Saboom is... Here we go. Here we go. Nice. We're good. So yeah, so that jump is really cool. That's one of the few actual out of bounds of the game where we actually go outside the level's like intended geometry. Um, but there's going to be a couple, couple more of those. Well, really one, really specific one at the very end. But we'll talk about that when we get there. Chris getting a nice fast cycle on the big fatty right there. Big oh, fatty. What, is, whoa, what was that? Okay. <laughs> the big fan. You can see with Saboom. <laughs> yeah, you can see with Saboom that uh, sometimes those fat guys like to kind of troll you a little bit. So if you don't get them just right, they'll just block that entire area for their entire death animation. Yeah, they're jerks. And they're ugly. <laughs> that does. Not as ugly as Nasty Nork. Yeah. By the way, guys, I want you to know that Nasty Nork is beautiful. Don't let yeah. anybody tell you like how to, you know, perceive, you know, your fellow man or Nork. Yeah. Everyone has their natural beauty. You're beautiful. Everybody, on even the Wally inside. is naturally beautiful. Can you guys yeah. believe that? And if that ain't a testament to that, I don't know what it is. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, gee, thanks, guys. <laughs> got you. All right, so here we got the fountain jump right here. Now. Nice, we got it. So this jump, that jump is so finicky. Um, these guys go through it really quick, quickly, but there's um, only like a couple of like real pixels, a couple of polygons, I should say, that you can stand on for that fountain right there. And that's the only fountain that you can ascend up to the upper level there. Uh, normally you're supposed to go all the way like kind of around the level and take like a uh, one of those like windmill kind of things back up. <laughs> What's the word? Yeah, wind, wind, wind tunnel. I always call it a windmill. Whirlwind? Whirlwind. Whirlwind. Yeah. A windmill. <laughs> I'm still getting the terminology. Like in Robotica Farms, like riding up the... <laughs> yeah, there you go. So yeah, play this game for like five plus years and still getting the terminology wrong. Oh, hell yeah. Okay, oh, so over apparently. that hill right there that uh, Saboom just hit, um, right before the thief, um, you saw like a really cool thing that, um, that, you, that they're going to be doing a lot in the run, which is holding X and square on very specific, almost like 45 degree angled upward slopes. Um, and what that does is it kind of glitch, glitches out the jumping charging animation um, so that he's actually ascending the hill um, as fast as the game will, will let him, as opposed yes. to just charging up. And, and you know what word I like for that is skitter. I think that yeah. Kate actually started saying that. And I, I it's called a skitter? Really, yeah, I'm really yeah. fond of that. Doesn't that just like perfectly describe like what's going on? We need more good names like that for this stuff. Yeah, right? <laughs> I'm tired of getting confused by all this windmill. <laughs> right. I'm a bit upset that Spiral Reignited called them metal back spiders. Oh. Huh. Uh, that's what I said on the fan that's made wiki. Bad, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Their actual name is Nightmare Fuel. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty much. Alright, nice. We got the clutch boxes right there. See if Spoon's got them. Clutch box. Clutch H yeah, fan. Shout out to Smash Summit if you don't mind. Yeah, dude. If you're watching our stream instead of Smash Summit. Yeah. Then. Dude, I've been watching all kinds of streams today, man. Oh, there's so much good shit going on. <laughs> all right, so we're getting out of here right now. We're almost done with Stonehill. Guys, getting right out of here. He's pretty hype. So booms maybe like a maybe like 10, 20 seconds behind. This is definitely still a race for sure. Yeah, this is freaking exciting, man. Yeah. I mean, I went from getting a 14-minute artisans to this, so. Yeah, I'm like, holy shit, Chris, I told you, man, he just needed that one run to de-rust and, like, he'll, he'll be golden. As for me, I didn't, I didn't really know what to expect because I actually haven't played this video game in, like, two or three months. Like, <laughs> so, I don't know. Yeah, same. Especially with Reignited having come out, it's like, I'm, I've completely forgot how to play this game, actually. <laughs> That's how I felt when I did that run. <laughs> I'm like, what the hell is this? It, it makes me feel like a casual player again. It's kind of like liberating in that way. Uh, yeah. Reborn a casual. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that's how I feel. <laughs>
But what is most important is we're just chilling. Yep. That is most important. Chilling. With some nugs and beer. <laughs> Although I gotta say, Dale, your nugs jacket's like really warm. Like it's almost too warm. <laughs> <laughs> gotta take the jacket off. I got your back. Down. <laughs> Literally. Literally. <laughs> You're on my back. <laughs> Literally on your back. Get off my back, man. <laughs> Someone go faster. Dude, I freaked up, man. I didn't get those white chests at the right time. <laughs> what are you... No, and keep in mind, to anyone who's watching this right now, if Saboom seems like a little bit behind, or even if he gets like a minute plus behind, for example, he can still bring it back at the end because there is a really tight trick at the end that hopefully these two um, expert players are going to get yeah. first try, but um, we're going to see what happens there because it can be really finicky and it could cost you minutes. Almost you definitely. get a very precise trick at the end of the game. Be a big race changer trip. for sure. Yeah, so no matter how far apart they ever get, like, there's always actually hope that one of them can bring it back. Each time you fail a trick, you lose like around a minute at least. So. Yeah. And since we're talking about it, I think I'll touch on it for a second right now. The trick is called credit skip, and um, to put it like simply, uh, we bounce off of Nasty Nork and flame him from underneath while simultaneously flying into the lava to kill Spyro, and then we get his gems, and then we skip the credits because we got the gems and caused a death animation, which respawns Spyro and allows us to exit the level without watching the three and a half minutes before entering Nasty's room. There you go. Very, very good. Simple. Game over. Spoiler alert. Or feel good. Yeah, spoilers. Over. There is a level after Nasty North. No, there isn't. <laughs> Don't let them lie to you. Ooh, Chris with the recovery. Very nice. <clears throat> okay. All right. Here we go on Toasty. Not a whole lot to say in this level, just a lot of really kind of precise charging that's happening here. One interesting thing to note um, is that the um, these Shepherd guys who are also on um, Stone Hill, um, only on the NTSC version of this game can you actually charge into them. But the gem won't home into you. So that's kind of interesting. And so of course when I got Spyro Reignited Trilogy, I was like, all right, I gotta, I gotta charge into these guys to see what happens. And of course, NTSC is best TSC, so of course you're <laughs> in. <able to> <laughs> of course. They home in now too, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Oh my goodness. I still prefer J, where you can charge into the Shepherds and the Dogs gems home in. Yeah, if anyone in the chat hasn't seen a, a Spyro 1 Japanese playthrough, oh, uh, check it out on YouTube or check out Wally's channel, because... Um, it's a sight to see, and let's just say it's not exactly as fast as this version. Yeah, Japanese are freaking hype, dude. It's a lot more killing on the fingers, I'll just say that. Oh god, because like the constant X is square. <laughs> yeah. That's all you'll hear. Yeah, I love how they put a little sound effect to it. It's, it's like good. Mario. <laughs> yeah, dude. That's what makes Mario so great, is he's constantly like making all these noises. I Love think they it. were trying to like copy Mario. <laughs> failed really probably. bad. <laughs> that was probably their inspiration. They're like, oh, SM64 is such an amazing Yeah. Game. <laughs> so they tried to make the camera more like it or something, and like give them noises and stuff. Didn't really work out. <laughs> yeah. First, coming to the end of Artisans here. I'd say he's about 15 ahead of Saboom. I'd say. Maybe Last not that. Way. Very nice. Guys. I would say he's about 15 behind. So there. <laughs> Saboom's in the future. It's all a matter of how you look at it. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it is. And see, time is relative. You know, Einstein <laughs> theorized, like, I could very well be ahead right now. It's true. You know, time actually moves and I faster could be in a box. Planets, so <laughs> if we actually yeah. move over to Jupiter, uh, that yeah. might be the fastest way to speedrun this game. Yeah, fight me on Jupiter, Chris. You won't. We'll see who wins. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let me just board my spaceship. <laughs> the, the faster you move, the slower time goes around. It's time dilation, bitch. 
<laughs> Maybe Marco the balloonist will take me there. Oh, Dude, shout outs to, uh, to Night Flight, which is like the comfiest flight level in my opinion. Super oh, good yeah. music, super good vibes, and just like, yeah, a lot of nostalgia feels. But let's get a resident sleeper for like. Can we get a resident e sleeper for the. It's for the like the loudest level? sound and track, a little so. It requires both, you know? Yeah. A hybrid emote of Resident Sleeper and Lucy. We're gonna need an emote for every level. <laughs> they already have one, dude. It's called Boom Kemba Z. <laughs> for every level. Yeah, I can see it. <laughs> I miss my boy Kemba. Where it could be he? feels bad, man, for dude. Misty Bog because of the frogs. Can we just use this this platform right here to give a huge shout out and uh, have you seen this man to Kemba Waka Flocka who has been gone for a minute now. Seriously. We want to say Kemba, if you're listening to this, we miss you. We love you. We want to see you bring the back hike and again. I love Come you, Kemba. Whilst we're, whilst we're at it, we'll give some shout outs to our boys Jay Wrights and Shredwalk. Okay, so here's the really sick wall glide. All right, Chris, getting the recovery, nice. So that wall glide's crazy because you really do gain a lot of altitude on it if you get it. Let me see if Saboom gets it real quick. I got dicked. <laughs> yeah, so the, if you if they get that wall glide without falling into the lava, it's actually a really cool one because it really shoots Spiral upward into the air, which is like kind of counterintuitive because he's supposed to fall down as he's gliding. Um, but the cool, also the cool thing about that, as you saw from both of these expert players, is that um, you can just fall in the lava and there's just barely enough space to land a charge glide, or just like a charge onto the um, onto the platform there without having to use the intended platform to reach it. But Deo, man, what's this lava in which you speak? I only see purple drink. <laughs> yeah, it's some lean, you know. <laughs> it's some grape juice. But you know, Spyro is uh, it's allergic to to purple drink. Yeah. It's a shame. Liquid yeah, I'm also sad that in, like right. I'm sad that in reignited, like all of the water sources are like actually water, and it doesn't show Spyro like drowning in it, like it does in this game. Like it's a little sadistic. It's like his head like falls under. It's like what? he's suffocating. Uh, snap! See, I didn't even know that. It, it, it's very sad when you. You cheat the game, and so Spyro's just there with his head above the water, infinitely. <laughs> yeah, there's a cool glitch in this game where you can, um, you can actually, uh, fool the game Jesus. into thinking you're in a death state, um, when actually you're not, and you're still able to control Spyro, even though the game thinks that you're dead. So what that allows you to do is, uh, we call it zombie, and what it allows you to do is just walk on top of, uh, all of the purple drink and all the lava and all of the, all of the green, delicious Mountain Dew. <laughs> it's fun times. Zombie definitely takes more effect than Spyro 3 though, as we're seeing in the any percent speed run. Oh yeah. Shoutouts to uh Zeus part, right? Who won? Uh Zeus won yeah, Zeus won. in second. GG Zeus, you got some nuggets on the way. <laughs> <laughs> I told these guys, whoever wins this race is getting some free nuggets courtesy of Deo. Where, where's mine? You don't Stream get is sponsored by 7-Eleven, reminder. <laughs> Go out and check into your neighborhood 7-Eleven. Get some good stuff, you know? Yeah, if they don't already have the nuggets there, just be sure to ask one of the workers to have them shipped in. They actually <laughs> can and will do that for you. Deo, do you get the taquitos? Dude, yeah, I did actually. I'm rocking yeah, some dude. taquitos right now. I got some lion. <laughs> oh, <this> shit. <laughs> Chris, how do you know my life, bro? <laughs> the taquitos are the best. Yeah, they're good. <laughs> Hashtag not spawn. But wish we were. Yeah, I agree. But feeling it, it's faulty. Can we get on this? Can we get Spyro from sponsored by some of them? I think the answer to that, Silver, is you should move to somewhere where there's a 7-Eleven. Uh, there we go. But Silver, how do you not have a 7-Eleven around you, man? I don't think we have any here either. either. Oh, really? Sad day, man. Is there a 7-Eleven around here? 
So yeah, the stream is sponsored yeah, by 7-Eleven. Um, <laughs> Download the app. Download the app. Because <laughs> Deo told you. Dude, you know what else kind of makes me sad, though, is that Jimmy John's does not exist outside of the States. So, like, people who don't live in the seen U.S. I've never Jimmy John's in my life, and I'm a proud United Statesian. Snap, dude. You haven't you never even seen United one? United Statesians. Chris dude, you better Google laughing. right now. Jimmy Go John's back to Canada, to Chris. and fucking go grab a sandwich, man. Just tell him, oh, I know Steven, he works for Jimmy John's, and like, he told you to give me a free sandwich. <laughs> like in another state, they're like, oh yeah, yeah Steven, you mean Yeah, oh right? yeah, we've heard about that, you mean the legendary <laughs> driver who's like known by all the Jimmy John's stores around the Okay, so, so quick gameplay like talk right here. So in Clifftown, you're supposed to fly from the very top of the level to these areas that, the, that they were just accessing that had the fireworks as well as a few chests. Um, by abusing charge glides, they're able to get to those areas earlier and uh, make the whole route a lot easier, which is super cool, and this level is super cool. Same thing with the beginning of the level, they were able to abuse a really cool uh, jumping charge um, to get around the uh, first area, which again, is meant to be accessed after the end of the level. At least that's that's what I think is, is meant, I mean, we can't really know what the developers I intend. Was yeah, sometimes it is tough to say. Exactly what was intended. Like for like for example, the um the fountain in Stone Hill, like it was that intended to be get up gotten up or not? Because I'm pretty sure I one of the dragons alludes to being able to use it, right? I don't think you're supposed to do a, a jump whilst rolling. I think the rolling is purely just an yeah. anti stuck counter yeah. measure. Oh, that was cold water. It's definitely to make sure that you don't like, magically go up really steep slopes, I think. Chris getting some good birds here. Yeah, pretty good birds. Yeah, this area with all the vultures can be... just lose you so much time. Yeah, these these birds will fly any direction they really want based off of how your camera is positioned as you approach them. As many of the enemy cycles in this game are set up, it's all about how you approach them with your camera that it will determine which direction they go, whether that's optimal or not. Yes, the moon's catching up here, man. Even pretty high. Uh, I think so. What's the timer at right now? 2045. All right. 2056. Yeah, we're, we're both having a pretty solid run so far. Chris definitely uh, really doing, I'm sure, better than you thought you would do, for instance, Chris. <laughs> After that one. Yeah. I feel that you're both doing Oh, Chris got screwed over by the cannon, dude. Rip cannon. And I pushed it too far. Oh, oh snaps. And the annoying- Oh, well, at least we got to see the guy's butt. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> I see it! I have the screen up. That made that it worth ass, it, actually. Uh-oh, you've just got mooned. Send this to ten of your friends to utterly moon them. <laughs> Will do. No. I do that already. So Saboom, did you come up with this little like route change at the beginning of Dr. Shem? Yeah, actually I did realize that doing the any percent stuff was like a little bit quicker than doing the way that we were doing it before. Yeah. So, oops. Yeah, I think, uh, I don't recall exactly, but it might have been like half a second faster or something. So, oof, kind of slow, but, or yeah, kind of like not huge. Yeah, I love a lot of the uh, route updates that uh, Saboom has implemented because, um, and by the way, Boom, Green Gem, maybe? Yeah. I know, huh? Yeah, Still I saw that. But, uh, what was I gonna say, um, see, aren't you glad you have us here? Just backseat yeah. gaming all day? No, that's uh, why I said, that's why, <laughs> what did I say? Oof or something, or big oof? Big oof. <laughs> big oof. <laughs> Mit me and Deo, your backseat casuals. Yeah, I'm just love a casual player, I've never played this game before. <laughs> I, I only play this game with Ultra Hatches. Or if it's J version. I just hop into people's chat and say, Are you excited for Reignited? Even though it already. <sighs> <laughs> yeah, I never realized that rhymed. That sounds beautiful. Are you gonna speed the Reignited oh. trilogy? Uh. But yeah, like seriously, big shout outs to Saboom because he has done pretty much like 99% of all of the. Um, the most recent routing in the past year or two um 
that's really kind of unlocked the door for a lot of new movement optimization. Um, that kind of led us to where we're at today. So. I feel so overcredited by that statement, but I'm going to take it anyway. Thank you. <laughs> okay, you can just skip those credits. You're good. Like, you, 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 you've definitely, Dang, that was slick. <laughs> you, you've you definitely been a contribution to most of the like different areas that have had different like movements. Yeah, like for sure. I mean, I still feel like Tuval is responsible for like 98% of what we actually yeah. are seeing in this run, you know? But I definitely like conquered a couple little areas and um, found something new or whatever. <laughs> Lofty. <laughs> yeah, this run is, yeah. this race is super neck and neck right now. I'm pretty hyped up. Yeah, dude, it's fucking awesome. I mean, yeah. swear yeah, jar, some 25 Z, some try hard, some dog uh -huh. face. Shout out to Hummel Dong, my boy. Oh, Hummel is amazing. Yeah, I love that guy. Hummel's my dad. I believe I saw him streaming 120% runs the day of the Reignited release or something like that. <laughs> that like, dude came into my chat like while I was playing Reignited and he was like, not you too, Deo. I'm <laughs> like, you're right, dude. I just wanted to put the game down right then. And... <laughs> what a pioneer. Yeah, champion. I did like one three and a half hour run of just 120% and I'm like never again. <laughs> Jumpy did try oh, here that. are the infamous poles. Yeah. Jumpy's so really these poles are ridiculous because if you can actually sideswipe them and avoid the bonk animation, but in certain situations it's actually faster to just bonk them if you've already kind of messed up the movement a little bit. So that's kind of what you're seeing a little bit here. There's another really cool like charge jump right there. And of course, all these guys right here that he's that they the big fatty metal guys, um, they're that last one was meant to be charged twice. At least that's what what I'm guessing. Again, I'm not a developer yeah. of this game, but that's what I'm guessing is it was meant to be charged twice. But by hitting him a certain way, you can uh, die very easily. Yeah, that angle is actually kind of tight to get him in that single shot off. Yeah, weird to get the movement right for it. Yeah. They're too close, this is not okay. Alright. When am I not hyped up? Dude, I'm always hyped up. Bro, Chris <laughs> and Shaboom are right here. This is the most legendary run you guys have ever seen. <laughs> uh, are you kidding me? No, I'm hyped for life, dude. <laughs> I'm hyped we got so many uh, people in the Spyro community in chat right now. We got White Paws, we got Hummel Dong, Expert on Nothing. All these people are always uh, super active in, in uh, chats and all that stuff. Dude, that's so funny. Themselves. We salute like a cool little community that's going on. For a second, it sounded like you had said like Hummel Dong, comma, who's you know like who's an expert on nothing. I thought you were saying. <laughs> <laughs> and then I'm like, oh yeah, wait a minute, I recognize that, that username. <laughs> Alex Dust, dude. Big shout out to Alex Dust. For Legend. dropping out. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, for dropping out of what? The commentary? Well, it's supposed to be a. No, never mind. I guess I shouldn't oh, even. <laughs> but. The secret has been spilled. Great run, Trash. <laughs> yeah. No, Alex, we love you, bro. Yeah, not lots here of to, love. not here to, to give you crap, bro. We're here to love. <laughs> We're here to give you chicken nuggets, actually. I'm here to give you chicken nuggets. <laughs> if you'd have just joined the race, you could have had some chicken nuggets. <laughs> Everyone, let's get some money together. Everybody's getting chicken nuggets. Oh, yeah. Okay. This is a reality now. Dude, yeah, we are super duper close. This is great. See, this has got to happen eventually at a GDQ, man. Me and the Chrisinator. Well, you should have submitted. 120 race. You should have submitted to SGDQ. I'm down. Well, they're never going to take it again. It's reignited. I know, right? now. Yeah. <laughs> it's over, boys. We missed our yeah. opportunity. Well, that's why we got Spyro. Dead. Magic crafters, things are gonna get interesting now. Oh yes, lots this is where of stuff to go wrong. The boys are separated from Back the men. If 
thought you said, thought you were gonna say the boys are back in town. The boys are back boys in town. Are back the in boys town. are back boys in town. Back in town. <laughs> <laughs> if anybody oh. wants to join in the post Sparrowfong karaoke session, that will be open hey. to everybody. Boys are back oh. in town. Okay, my career's over. I don't want it. <laughs> my singing career has come to an end. It's okay, dude. Uh oh. We'll still love you. It's okay, Dave. It's, it's just. Yeah. This is a level where I'm like, just a boy. Camera, and like how your fastness of how you do everything is going to affect a lot of the way the cycles are working. Um, like with these uh, stairs that they just passed by right now, all the way going through this uh, whole section off to the left of the level here. Um, you can see Chris got kind of screwed over by that uh, wizard right there, and that all had to do with the cycles Crap. and how he's approaching them. Uh, same thing with these like three uh, staircase steps right here. So that's all working out pretty nice. So there's just a lot of like moving parts in this level, so it's interesting to see how uh, differently like an optimal quote unquote uh, route through the level would go. Because actually, when you go really fast through this level, um, there can be times where you have to slow down to like meet certain cycles and whatnot. As you move from one runner to another, you'll you'll definitely see the variations in cycles that people end up making. Like you'll have someone who can't really make any of the major cycles and will have to make up the backups. Yeah, indeed. Will consistently hit these faster cycles. God, yeah, this so one's hard. one of the toughest. Man in the chat. What up? What? I got fucking hit again? Here it comes, dude. The swift rage. That was a it weird It made no hit. sense. Yeah. That's happened to me multiple times now. I don't know. Dude, I hope Mega doesn't fall asleep before Lofty. This is getting pretty <laughs> late Mega, for why aren't you in the chargeless race tonight, bro? <laughs> You're the one who set it all off. <laughs> Oh Shout out to the chargeless race tonight. At, also, uh, where is chargeless well, on the boards? What the heck is going on? Dude, yeah, for real, huh? I thought we received uh, word that it would be added. It's more yeah, important that's what I thought. Right <laughs> <laughs> more important than chargeless. I don't know about that. <laughs> we have to re revolt. We need a revolution. <laughs> Mod purge. Yeah. <laughs> I'm the only god. De De Deo for series mod. Okay. <laughs> that was a big oof no. right there. The goof. Yeah, almost or a uh, big got wrecked. Goof. Yeah, no. When so, was the J version? picking up a bit of time over Saboom here on this level, but um, overall still pretty close. I would say within about 10 to 15 seconds. Hey, you must have got wrecked by the cycles earlier. <laughs> I had a death. I got killed by the oh. yellow big man <laughs> with the claws. <laughs> the yellow big the yellow man. big man. <laughs> Them goddamn. Okay, big so Chris is going for a pretty difficult charge here. You get that guy. But the thing that actually makes this charge difficult isn't this part of it, but it's actually hitting the uh, two metal guys after coming out of high cave. So be on the lookout to see if he actually hits these two guys right ahead of him. Yeah, that could be a game changer too. It's like eight seconds. Yeah. I reckon we're not a whole lot more than eight seconds apart. No, you guys are pretty close. First, we got to see how this level goes, because this level can certainly cause some pretty major time loss as well. Oh, what the... Really crucial flame charges here at the beginning of this level. Yeah. And I'll take advantage of this moment to say that flame charging, um, you know, a lot of the enemies in this game, um, it varies in difficulty. Like with these big yeah. fat wizard guys, it's pretty hard to flame charge them. You gotta get really close to them. You gotta hit, you gotta smash, smash that like button. You, know, you gotta smash <laughs> where it's super hard. Um, and I was actually watching Chris and Saboom at, um, at uh, GDQX and they actually have like kind of like their own like special kind of patented technique for how they like use like the knuckle on their thumb you know, rolling over to the square button. Um, so it's just crazy, like, how tight um, the timing is for, like, a lot of the movement tech happening here. Oh, for sure. And the wizards, too, like, their corpses get so in your way that the the hardest part about it is just not bonking on them yeah. after here. Like, yeah. yeah, that's a, also another really good point. If you have to get really close to an enemy, 
and then flame charge them. Well, their their hitbox is still active after they uh, after they get killed by your flame. So like, like with the thieves here, like we're bonking into them. Now, interestingly, Chris got a really cool like little skip. Same with Saboom there. They got a really cool little skip on the thief where um, if you charge and then jump and flame all at the same time while hitting the thief in midair, then you will skip the animation or you'll be able to skip the animation more quickly for the uh, for collecting the egg from that thief. All these little things save like less yeah. than a second, but compounded over the course of an hour and a half run. Um, I mean, just look at the leaderboards. It makes like minutes and minutes of difference. Yeah. Both of our players getting up to the ferry. Oh. There, really good work. They're gonna try and bring the this flame world. all the way down. What are they called? To... Metalback spiders? Yeah, that's something bullshit. stupid. I don't know. <laughs> They made them into spiders. spiders, at least. They more look like spiders now. Dude, wait, is there a new development in the Spyro lore? Are the spiders actually the spawn of Metalhead? No, oh. that's just the community. <laughs> no, that's- oh, what? <laughs> I can get behind that. <laughs> You're just the spawn of Metalhead. Does I mean, have that mean peacemakers and magic crafters are at war? Like Breeze Harbor and Zephyr? <laughs> Oh my god. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, guys, just check our Tumblr page if you want to follow on our <laughs> Life is Tumblr. Shit, I better get one then, because I, I ain't got one. <laughs> okay. You and then with the life. last few, uh, I'm just now figuring end. this out. <laughs> With the last few fan chests at the end, they really uh, made sure to turn Spyro just enough so that um, the fan from the chest connected with the uh, thief that was off screen. So that's yeah, how we got that. Now see. watch out for the two metal guys. Let's see what we got here. I miss. Okay, Chris, I think missed one there. Chris is missing the right one. Saboom nailing both of them. Dude, I said this might be the comeback yeah, for Saboom. Buddy. This is heated. <laughs> so heated. Wizard Peak. A very difficult level here. Oh yes. A lot of things to go wrong. Sabim's so gonna be attempting a wizard proxy probably? Yes sir. He nice. better get it. I hope so, fingers crossed. And just to calm down um, for what they mean, a proxy is basically a bounce off of an enemy. So you're gonna try to bounce a spiral off of a wizard here to hopefully save some time. Yeah, where, where is in the Spyro 3 any percent run where they were using more or less squeeze proxies and dead body proxies? These are just animation proxies. <laughs> Basically, the enemies have a certain animation that will just squeeze you into the air, and you'll be able to just do whatever the hell you want to do with that. <laughs> yeah, just do magical, well put, mystical, well. magical things. Dude, it's really weird because I felt like there was a cat touching my ankle or something, but we don't have a cat. <laughs> and Saboom nailing that perfectly. I think it was a metal. Yeah, that was dope. Bro. Hell yeah. I didn't want to spoil or anything, but hell yeah. And then, Chris, I'm going to go for a couple of these. Yeah. See what Saboom Chris, got. Chris is going for the more difficult supercharged strat. There is another one, but. It's yeah, there's like, a few different so. strategies there, but I, I personally like the Chris strat. <laughs> With the one that I use. <laughs> yeah. Wait, did Saboom get the, uh, the proxy? Hell yeah, yeah boy! What the heck?! Probably. What?! <laughs> yeah. Yo, this, uh, I think Saboom's in the lead right now, let's go! Look but Saboom doesn't do the fast island! No! Let's go! I know, Saboom doesn't do the fast island. Oh my god, what? this is heated! This Dude, is the most heated hell yeah. This is more heated than your jacket, man. <laughs> I'm, yeah, like, burning up over here. <laughs> First hand heated. Oh, <clears throat> yeah, and shout outs to Wally for uh, finding a really cool strat where you pick the gems up through the wall of that uh, little section where the thief is on the island. Living up to his name. Huh, <laughs> wall strat for Wally. <laughs> the Wally. Dude, that makes. I never thought about this. What more could I find? Put it on the spot. <laughs> I was thinking proper to going all the way out just for loose gems when I could just grab those loose gems and then just don't yeah. really have to worry about spring chests. 
Dude, so boom, did you hit triple treat? Uh, did I? I think so. I oh. honestly forgot already. <laughs> if not, reset, honestly. Yeah, truth. <laughs> Yo, chat, should we reset so we can get more civilian quest time? <laughs> <laughs> or let's make it like a two out of three. Oh, here we go. Yeah, back. the triple treat! <laughs> There you go. Oh, Chris bringing the hype in all three yeah. boxes at once. What a, and getting hit by the big fatty. Very lucky. <laughs> Dude, I'm honestly really surprised that it's still possible in reignited to do triple treat. Oh, yeah, it is really okay. slower, but it's possible. You know, I wasn't hitting it's that. Slower? Like... It's slower no, than doing like... them all individual? No, it's not slower. Uh, oh, but you meant like it's slower than in this game. Yeah. Uh, Triple kit is also high. possible in charge of. Well, everything's slower in Reignite. Uh -huh. The loading times are like twice as long for every load. Yeah. <laughs> like, yeah. how do they not improve on that? Like after. I know, years. isn't that funny? Like, if you think about it, I mean, as games have developed, like the loading times though seem to have just gotten. They just get worse. Time. Everyone's yeah. like, oh, it's all about the graphics, blah blah blah. But then it's like, what about the actual like convenience of like playing a game? Yeah, like. <laughs> like I don't know. What about not having to wait a minute just to like move around on a level <laughs> so real quick um these guys are both in i believe this is crystal flight yes um yes. going into this level um they jumped through the portal in a very specific way where they actually touched the dragon on the other side of the portal um while appropriately they, yes, they touched him appropriately okay don't yeah. get any weird <laughs> ideas like that we're, we're being okay. correct yeah. But, uh, yeah, so by touching that dragon while entering the portal, uh, you basically skip the dragon's uh, whole, like, explosion thing that he does. Um, he and that is, in fact, the only... <laughs> BOOM! <laughs> I saw that, Shamu. <laughs> yeah, the freaking fun. I had a dollar for every time I did that, dude. Yeah. My gosh. Wouldn't have to work a day in his life. Can, can we have a replay on that boom, please? That, that was... BOOM! <laughs> BOOM! I would destroy everyone's so ears, but I can't be bothered. Every time you drop the bomb, you kill the child. Yeah. There was a god, your child <laughs> was born. It's booted by system of a down. Oh my god. That was so beautiful. But I'm crying. Again, post for a fun karaoke meeting. <laughs> Everyone's Boom, still got sparks. So boom with a sizable lead on Chris Ryan. This is pretty heated. So can Chris bring it back? Sizable, huh? Small, medium, or large? Um, um or a kid. Let's call this one a smallish medium. <laughs> Small. Yeah. Did they serve yeah. that at 7 Eleven? Smallish medium. You have to size? order that size, actually. Oh, okay, you gotta tell the employee, hey, like, <laughs> I want my shit in smallish medium size. You better, like, import <laughs> it directly. <laughs> If I don't have exactly 500 grams. <laughs> A kid's large. <laughs> Why did I do that? A kid's large, aka a thick with one C. Oh! Okay. Baby. Uh, Chris doing the thing that everybody who's ever played this game before has done. Unfortunately, uh, Chris uh, didn't back it up, so. Yeah, I saw that. But it's all good. It's all good. You, you can panic and you get back up onto the platform. I've done that about good. Just a quick reminder, even though Chris may seem a little bit behind right now, um, there's a 100% possibility that they can get near the very end of the game and completely turn around this race based off of a uh, credit skip. So, Actually, question, Chris. Uh, how many tries did it take in the run you just did to get credit skip? I did poverty credit skip because I didn't like... Oh, is that the one I where you like, open your tray? Like three yeah. times. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> snaps. I'm already credit scared. Scared. Dude, I gotta learn oh, how to do oh, that. Oh. What is that? I'm confused. It's where you open your disk tray and then the credits just and stop it... loading. Yeah, it just like skips a minute and a half's worth of credits or some shit. I've never heard of that. That's crazy. So like, yeah, it's actually when you play nasty, you like open your tray. Yeah. Uh, after after the cutscene. In the credits. Yeah. yeah. Like obviously so it's, it's not grass. faster, but it's still like decent. I'm gonna call that use of third-party hardware <laughs> banned. Chris yeah. and Saboom, you guys are now banned. What? Right now, I've never done it a time in my life. <laughs> How dare you ban my boy Saboom? I'm gonna ban you. Yeah. You know, I'm gonna ban you. I'm the only no. leaderboard mod now. <laughs> you just established that. 
As your resident ETD moderator, I'm, I'm telling you to stop. Yeah. I'm gonna take it one step further and ask... I'm, I'm gonna request that a 7-Eleven employee ban you. <laughs> <laughs> that would just break my heart, honestly. Yeah. After all that we've been through. Add insult to injury. Alright, back to the severe one anyway. This is Terran's anyway, Village. This run. is another cycle based level and they're gonna be attempting yeah. a cycle simply known as the God Cycle. There's nothing more to yeah, say. Yeah, got a really good uh, little cycle there at the end. That was nice. Yeah, well, it turned out pretty good. You see how good you're nice. Yeah, Boom is getting a really good cycle right now. And it's not like the God Cycle is even that easy. Like, there's a lot of tricky movement in here in order to make the cycle that Saboon just made. Mm, I don't know if I got like the true God Cycle, but yeah, I probably got like just one behind actually... it. it was, that was pretty Dang. good, though. Yeah. That was, that's better than any cycle I've ever done. I didn't even stop the charge, Saboon. This guy's a madman. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, that's probably one of my favorite levels, honestly. Terrorist Village. Terrorist nice. Village? <laughs> Whoa, easy <Why> there. <laughs> oh no, dude. Let's be sensitive uh, to all the terrorists out there. God, we're gonna get demonetized. <laughs> <laughs> I'm kidding right now? Okay. okay so, so, Boom got the God Cycle on that electrocution. <laughs> yeah, I got scared because I thought I did like the soft lock thing. You got the infinite, yeah. Yeah. So, what talking about you can actually get an infinite like damage right there, where Spyro's just infinitely being electrocuted, <laughs> and until another enemy like um, sparks the, um, or until that enemy sparks the uh, the pad again, Spark or Spyro just keeps on uh, getting electrocuted, and he just killed the enemy right there. So if he'd have gotten that, he would have been. Uh, no, but I mean, like, that. have you seen the one where you're legit, like, trapped there, like, forever? Yeah. I mean, it's run over. Yeah. Like, yeah. you can just you get really stuck can't... there. Yeah, because if you try to, like, yeah. reset, you can't, like, you can't pause the game, can you? Uh, or even... I think you can. You, you can, can but the even game, then, if you, you quit can. game, you don't, you don't have any save file. Yeah. So at that yeah. point, like, you have to literally reset the whole run. Yeah. So that's one of those few choke points. Definitely. That... Yeah, I've lost runs though, man. Right? <laughs> it's sad. Like, you lose runs to that, or you can lose runs to not having sparks for the infinite in Terra's Village. It's just a whole bunch of just baloney. Yeah. Baloney. Chicken uh -huh. nuggets. You get hungry. Dude, damn, I haven't eaten in over 40 hours, man. It, it looked like Chris was on some cycle, however, it doesn't seem like this ending has been preferable for him. Boom getting a, a beautiful strat on Wild Flight here. Loving this. And then oh, Jesus. Deo jinxing yeah. it. <laughs> <laughs> That's fine. Normally, what happens is Spiral just flop down into the blue lemonade and yeah. get destroyed. As you can see, Chris is over here in Mountain Dew Land. Taking care of stuff, so boom, joining him. <laughs> <laughs> the extreme gamers drink. We, we're not sponsored by Mountain Dew either. Yeah, we are. Well, if we were to be sponsored by 7 Eleven, maybe like indirectly, but you know, because they sell Mountain Dew, like, I could see it happening. <laughs> could work out. Marketers, get on this. Yeah. Alright, so here comes one of the most annoying levels in the whole game. Teapot. Does anyone care to explain why this level is so horrible? Frogs! Cold-blooded killers. What are the name of these, like, little bush guys? Like, what are you supposed to call them? They're Terror. just trees, I think. I don't know. They're just trees. You're supposed to call them Gimme Tree Fitty. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, the yeah, frogs, the, the trees... The turtles are horrible, the tree the tree fitties are horrible, <laughs> and everything is horrible. And then there's two oh, words. This level is One. home to the worst like island of enemies in the entire game, which we love to refer to as Guantanamo Bay. Yeah, reminder for the karaoke. Guantanamo Bay. <laughs> Guantanamo Bay karaoke? Yes. Yeah.
attack? Frogs? <laughs> question mark? Three question marks? Five? Possibly more? <laughs> <laughs> nah, they look like frogs, they sound like frogs. Therefore, they are frogs. Sounds sound to me. Sounds to me. <laughs> Sounds to me you got a few frogs there, fella. Got a frog in my throat. However, when I, whenever I play this level, I seem to get hit mostly by these knife guys, though. So. Yeah, <laughs> if, you, if you miss them while you're charging right next to yeah. them, then... Yeah. Yeah, you get a quick yeah. slash from them. That shank. Quick slice. Yeah, they shank you. It's unforgiving. So boom, doing a charge jump there after that fan jest. Oh, yeah. One of the most swag. Dude, I love it. Strat size. That's the Tuval, man. Found another, it. another lost legend of our community. Shout out to the friendly resident. Well, it's, not, it's not totally lost. No, he was in the chat earlier. Tempo, Did you see him? He's... He was in the chat in Spiral. Oh, he's here right now? No, no, no probably not right now, but he was earlier. Really Tuval, show yourself. I know you're lurking, bro. <laughs> it's probably like 2 in the morning for him. Yeah, as you say, he keeps a pretty, like, normy sleep schedule these days. So. Oh yeah, isn't it, like, super late in, like, the UK right now? Mm. Yeah, 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 that's what Chris was just saying. It might be, like, 2 a.m. or so, depending on where. It's 1 a.m. Oh, yeah. And I'm supposed to be up for a run at 8. You can tell where my priorities lie. Hey, <laughs> we're in the right place, dude. All on yeah. fire. Hell, why am why isn't me and Dale racing right now? Yeah, guy, forget this boring race. I want to see a chargeless race. <laughs> just That'll cut us it. right now and just put it on the charges. <laughs> yeah. Nice, Chris. Good little charge there. Oh. So here in treetops, they got a lot of really cool uh, supercharged ramp manipulation that's kind of happening. Essentially, if you charge onto a super uh, charge ramp um, from the air with full speed, um, then you'll technically get more speed than intended from a single ramp. So we use that to reach the island off to the left, as well as uh, just generally go faster. Not to mention this level can feature a lot of death abuses as well. Yeah. Like most of your backups will be in the form of death abusing, which is something that I don't think we've seen much of so far, but it's just something that will make things a lot more. Yeah, so that's like one of the first death abuses we've seen actually so far is right there. And see if he gets the island. Looking good. Yeah, that's very, very good. good. Yeah, I don't know. Shoutouts to anybody who was like a kid and trying to figure out how to get to that. Uh, <laughs> Quite I'm perplexing. Sure that, I'm pretty sure I got over to there like that. So. Oh snap. Child genius. I don't think I was ever fast enough to see where the thief went. <laughs> uh, oh wait a minute, but you had pal grown up, so it's like free on pal. <laughs> No longer child genius. Child average person. <laughs> <laughs> also, shouts to Pal, where Spyro is a freaking sports car. Yeah. Room, room. <laughs> <laughs> Boom, can I just say I love you, bro? I love you too, Deo. You already know, man. Yeah, man. Can we get some love in the chat? Can we get some, can we get some less yeah. than threes? Yeah, can we get some pride? Come on. Yeah. Some Kappa prides up there. Proud to be a human being. <laughs> Let's join together as we 
pronounce as these two human beings pronounce their love for each other. No, we pronounce our love for chicken nuggets, though. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Also, oh, Sabu, pick it up. You understand my love for that stone knot? Oh, yeah. Dude, I'm really, like, kind of nervous about how credits skip might go, though. It's legit, like, I haven't done it in a long time. <laughs> It sounds like Saboom is really confident about his chances yeah. for credit skip. Uh, <laughs> watch out, Chris. That's all I'm going to say. I'm nervous. It sounds like he's so confident. Booming with confidence, one might say. Okay, where did that flame go for Chris there? Did the, what the thing? It became reignited for a sec. Oh, oh, no. oh god. Never go full reignited. <laughs> it went for reignited. <laughs> it literally did. Just it went. It became useless. Hey, but at least the graphics are nice. Yeah, dude. That's all that matters. True. No. <laughs> <laughs> graphics are not all that matters. Thank you. It's, it's, it's 28. Fire <laughs> reignited is clearly a better version of this game. Yeah, all You're the casuals blind. will tell you that. Yeah. Who's paying you to say this day? 7-Eleven? <laughs> okay, I'll let them off. Don't they 7-Eleven? I'm on. Maybe. Oh my god. 7-Eleven interested. Right, let me get a Slurpee, I'm on it. <laughs> Spy yo. Reignited. Very nice. So can I get a show of hands in chat? Who's having a good time? Put your favorite emote with the forward slash after it to raise your hand in the chat room. Oh, you said favorite on <coughs> Oh no. Not too many. I'll pick one, mate. I'm gonna I'm gonna have to go with a colon. I'm gonna have to go with a capital B. Close parentheses. Oh yeah, my Stop streaming. <laughs> <laughs> Stop. Oh, there it is, the freaking boomer later. Oh snap! Capital B, open parentheses, or if you're a Brit bong, dude, so oh, close brackets. Who's winning? I'm winning. Yeah, Deo is definitely winning because he because I'm wearing his jacket. <laughs> so, yeah. I'm playing actually. Yeah. I'm channeling the, the no. spirit of Deo, man. I think the chat is winning. Yeah, honestly, so. it's the chat. We do it for you guys. Yeah, we love you guys. Not like that. Yeah, only only, only, Deo, like that only Deo loves you like <laughs> that. <laughs> Sorry. I have a romantic relationship with chat. <laughs> I pretend not to love you, but in in truth, you all love my heart. <laughs> You're oh. a heartbreaker, Wally. <laughs> Jack can handle you. Oh my goodness! All right, beast makers. Beast makers done. Let's go. Hype up. Dude, you have no um, idea how freaking starving I am right now, though. And I, I keep thinking that there's, like, food for me after this run, but... but there is, bro. There's chicken nuggets on route oh. via express mail. Okay, all right. I will trust our, you know, shipping services. No matter how many times USPS has let us down. They're seriously known as, like, the worst service. Really? Yeah, well, maybe maybe that's just around here or something, but... UPS and FedEx are, like, so much better than USPS. Mm, that's I what disagree. most people say. You disagree? Oh, fair, mm -hmm. fair. <laughs> Boom, yeah, who are you talking to, bro? <laughs> Dude, I don't know, it's just kind of the common... <laughs> You're having a here. conversation <laughs> with yourself right now, man. Get it together, you gotta win this race, bro. <laughs> Do it for the chicken nuggets. Uh, I don't uh, think Sabum has anything to worry about. Th th that's how chill this is. They're not even focused in on the game. <laughs> like some Honestly, at this point, these guys can just autopilot it and still, like, yeah. get, like, a top five time. Easy. 
Alright, Haunted Towers. Yeah, and we're in the fuck. We got the, the door right there. GG, boom. It's the we're level for, Oh, we're jump. going for the- Oh! oh. oh. That's See, that always boxy. happens now. Yeah, I haven't gotten it in so long. I want a dry streak. I need to, like, figure out why. So, shout to the route for Haunted Towers, which was made up in a dream. Yeah. <laughs> That's the best part of the speedrun lore. <laughs> Haunted towers in the Dreamweaver's world, made up by a dream. Yeah, huh. that's something. Shoutouts to our friend, Jumpy Buff. Who is going hard on the SRT trilogy. Love. Oh yeah. yeah. Our favorite fairy just gave us an amazing kiss right there. That was a 10 out of 10 kiss. Would kiss again. <laughs> Super romantic. RateMyKiss.com This game is a romance game, you know? It's actually 18 or over, believe it or not. Damn, dude. Better stop telling all these, like, elementary school kids that you're having their boyfriends and girlfriends already, then. <laughs> so you gotta be 18 for romance. Like, Spyro has a girlfriend, why don't I? <laughs> who, who, needs a, who needs a girlfriend when you can have a fairy dressed yeah. in gold? You have a fake fictional character as a girlfriend. Yeah, that's that's how, that sounds legit. No, not animes. Anime counts. No. <laughs> <laughs> you say my anime wife doesn't count? Yes. <laughs> no, I'm always. Fight me. Oh, I say it does. So what does Chris say if he's the tiebreaker? <laughs> Your Deo's fate lies in your opinion, Chris. <laughs> yes. Yeah, hey. yes. <gasps> Anime yeah. is real. Confirmed. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Chris, for, for bringing my dreams to reality. No. No problem. <laughs> I do my best. The LBC has got your back. And no one was surprised. Oh. I was competing against Dale, man. I should have expected. A hell yeah in the pole. Oh, check I'll this out. The Chris is doing the turnaround on the uh, supercharged ramp, which in oh, my opinion nice. is the best route, even though many people it seem to disagree with that. Well, actually, apart from Proxy. Proxy. Yeah. Apart from Proxy, it's the best. Yeah, Proxy is the best route, but... Chris is Nobody like, does that. Number two. <clears throat> well, I tried okay. for it, but I've been failing it left and right lately. It's okay, we've at least seen one Proxy in... Haunted Towers. It's all good. Ooh, the plot thickens, so the fairy actually kissed Chris after already having devoted her love to some <laughs> <laughs> This is very juicy. Oh, yeah. Was you trust her? Also, Saboon? Ah. Yeah, like, it looked kind of good or something, but it didn't quite happen. So, but can it really be... Very tricky. <laughs> can it really be cheating if there's two Spyros? Ooh, mm. It's like an alternate universe. Yeah. That's true. Oh man, this I don't is, even know this what is getting too one. meta. You gotta check the rule book, man. Yeah. <laughs> can, can, can we not be meta about this, please? My brain can't handle this. Alright, Wally. For Wally's sake. Yay! <laughs> yeah. But are they really That's like great. two different universes if we're both racing at the same time? Surely it's yeah, really parallel. God damn it, damn! Parallel and surely it shows oh. that the fairy knows that we're in the same universe, and therefore is a cheating uh, wench. Damn. I'm pretty no, sure. No, because she can't tell the just... difference. She just thought that Pat... she thought that Spyro was just coming back for some more. You know? but... She thought she thought it was the same Spyro. Sure. Yeah. No, my wife this, said. Was... <laughs> this Spyro was <laughs> green. I swear it was you. <laughs> Maybe the difference is that one of the spirals is green. Oh man, now we're getting into some serious parallel universe stuff here. Dude, yeah. It's actually making By the way, chat, did now. you know that Spyro no. was originally green? And but they changed his color because he no, blended in with the grass. What about the composer? Molly? And Stuart oh. Copeland was the former drummer the police. of the police. Oh my god, are you kidding me right now? He actually apprehended more than there a thousand criminals in the police. 
<laughs> Did you know that Carlos, who voices Spyro, is also the Taco Bell dog? Uh, yeah, he is. He is no, that's he is. Uh, no, it actually is Carlos <laughs> Alasraki. Is it actually? Oh. Yeah, yeah, it's a boom. Get oh, Taco God. Bell. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Damn, how did I get to the move? Quiero Taco Bell. Yeah, I don't Everyone know, dude. Everyone's talking so about Top Penny, but... Oh, I've never <laughs> <I> heard that. <laughs> oh, here we go. Chris... Okay, almost. <laughs> yeah, right. And by almost, I mean fly. <laughs> yeah. By almost, I mean nothing but... <laughs> <laughs> Just trying to provide some encouragement for my boy over here. I don't need your pain. Either way, Dark <laughs> Passage. <laughs> dark Passage, Dank Passage, yeah. That Assage. That you want to pull Dank Assage, man. <laughs> Throw out your Kevin Turtles. You know? Kevin Turtle? Does anybody do use that emote anymore? Andre. I'm about to do it right now. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I thought Andre was all OP OP. So, Sabine, no, did, you, like... did you get that? Rocket. The rocket, yeah, okay. barely, barely. <laughs> I was a little afraid myself, but I heard it like, on my TV or whatever. That's the kind of cycle I like. Alright, alright. Uh, shoot. Yeah, these cycles can be kind of tight on Dark Hollow, especially considering if you like mess up a little bit, you'll just get chewed up by it. Chris has gone through unscathed, at least for this part. Very admirable. Question, do these dogs have one eye or two? Hmm. One deep. eye with two pupils or two eyes with one pupil each? Damn, does that like, exist? Like, are they just like, really, like, are their eyeballs like, merged together? I don't know. Yeah, Probably. I never thought about that, man. What the heck? <laughs> What if it's actually just like a flashlight? It's like the same like yellow color as like, lighthouses. Well, in reignited, they're just like regular dogs, so I just don't know anymore. What if, there, what if each of those dogs has a computer planted inside of it, and their eyes are just actually the viewfinder for a camera, spying it's on Spyro? Totally possible. Dude, I think he's on to something, man. Wait a minute, yeah. spy, Spyro. I think I'm starting <laughs> to see some. I'm starting to see some connections here. The spinoff to GI Joe. They told me not to start digging, and now I, now I know why. <laughs> Find dragons first, they said. No. Oh, yeah. And here we are. We're already at our last flight level. Game. Oh, bloody hell, yeah. And it's looking good. So we're back on track. We're killing it. I'm loving it. Yeah, if people aren't aware, this is the 120% speedrun. They're grabbing 14,000 gems, 80 dragons, and 12 eggs. <laughs> They've done most of that already. 12,000? <laughs> or 14,000? I'm pretty sure there's 12,000 gems. Or is it... 14? We'll just have to wait till the end to find out, I guess. We, we don't know. To, to be honest, us speedrunners... Like uh, us speedrunners are completely clueless on what games we play. Everyone I can knows. attest to this. Wait, so did you get him or? <laughs> oh, you got him! <laughs> Hell yeah! He what the, the heck? He I didn't know you could do that! It's the boom, what the heck? It's pretty tricky, but you can do it, yeah. What the heck? You so, kinda have to just like heck? flame and then pause right away and then just literally quit out of the flight, but then it like thinks that you still beat it. <laughs> Are you serious? Yeah. Dude, that is so sick. I just learned something right now. That's awesome. Also, it divides your time by 10 or some shit like that, because it said that my best time for completing the flight was 5.74 seconds, <laughs> instead of like 50 or whatever it should have been. It like messes up the time, that's crazy. Yeah. That's right, that's why time. we don't allow pausing for the leaderboard times. Yeah, so, if you're watching Saboom, don't fall asleep. Yeah. That's, that's crazy, crazy 5 man. seconds. I, I didn't know, know it did that. Screen, but... Yeah, it's the new IL strat, didn't you know? Free roll, Patiently waiting for another shot. 
But yeah, th this is one of the levels which have had the most rerouting, like, semi-recently. Yeah, and discoveries in just in general, I'd say, I guess. In terms of where we go with this supercharge, or like, what the overall route is when we get things. And turkey snipes and all that good stuff. Finding out the cycle, shout out to Chris, only to realize that the new route doesn't even need to abuse it, or like manipulate it. Yeah. <laughs> Talking about this cycle coming up with the three floating guys? Yeah. yeah. Because overall this whole level is a figure of eight, so... It doesn't seem to matter which way you go, you can often find your way to your destination. <laughs> Is Sabim gonna do the crazy supercharged stuff, or is he gonna play safe? Even Saboom doesn't know. <laughs> <laughs> That's part of his magic. Saboom weighs up his options. He's going for it. <laughs> Never totally mind. not a spoiler. <laughs> <clears throat> Alright. We got a little bonk, no biggie. Their last try here. Oh, biggie. Okay, different route here. He's going. Oh, he's going for the backup. Let's go. Oh, go. oh! Oh my god. <laughs> I love it, that dude. That was so. How do you do that, bro? <laughs> you just gotta believe. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, so you heard it here first, guys. So if you just believe in yourself, you, you can fly, fly above it. any level. <laughs> yeah. be super it's pretty much true. Guys, I think Sabim's actually cheating. Uh, I don't approve of this behavior. Um, I'm pretty sure you can't make a jump like that from normal jumping mechanics. So I'm gonna call yeah. that. Dang. In fact, um, I'm gonna revoke all of your times on the leaderboard. For every game you've ever played, so congrats on the 120 world ah, record. Chris. Hey, sweet! <laughs> <laughs> the worst day of my life. This is why I'm I not. I knew you were a cheater, Spoon. I trusted you. <laughs> <laughs> Let the community down. You are my friend. Yeah, the community asked asked for a martyr, and they got me. Oh, Dio, you Watch will lead us. Boom and Chris in the same level right now. They're still not that far off from each other. Maybe a minute at the most. And everything can change. Everything can change. On a New Year's too. Day. <laughs> All right, so I forgot that that, uh, that Cupid hit the box for me. I forgot that that happened. That's kind of funny. I had a turtle hit, like, a box and a dog earlier. <laughs> oh my god. It was a snipe city. Completely murdering his own brethren. <laughs> yeah, he just murdered. <laughs> <laughs> it's great. I think Saboon was attempting a very risky strap there, and then sort of pulled back. Yeah, oh, yeah, I mean, if, you, if I miss a flame, then I miss a flame. There's no use in trying again. But yeah, yeah, I was trying what, to flame it in advance. With what Saboom just did, that has a very high likelihood of crashing your game if you aren't fast enough, so... Yeah. Do it with caution. Oh dang, Mega, you're the one that found that, uh... Yeah, he's the pioneer of Yellow Roof. Dude, shout out oh, to Megalo, man. He did yeah. the very first Chargeless speedrun, to my knowledge. What a legend. Dude, I just realized, I think I have zero lives, too. Yeah. yeah. I was going for that single layer nonsense. You got it, so... Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dude, we got single layer cake? Fuck yeah. Alright, here comes Jockeys. Jockeys is a very special boss. 
there. It has two buttons. That is all that is special about Jacques. It has two dragons. Its boss oh is, yeah, its boss. that is different than all the others, huh? Its boss is also a Jacques in the box. A Jacques in the box. Alright, hold on. Everyone make the air horn, horn noise on three. One, two, three. Wait, what the fuck? <laughs> is that the noise it makes? Yeah, he just presses the button and it goes, wait, what the fuck? <laughs> no, oh, I am I'm Chris, fucked. Chris missing three gems. Yeah, that is, three gems. That is painful. I don't even know where they are. Like, if you haven't realized it yet, there is no free gem in in the game. game at all. <laughs> I know where I missed one gem, but it's a it, so it's know. at least two different. Oh, and rip to Saboom as well, missing that cycle. These guys are actually. Oh, oh my God! He almost got. What wow. a madman, dude! Going for that backup. He's going again. Oh, Get no. out of here, Saboom! Yeah, it's not that hard. <laughs> Get out of here! Oh, it's not that hard, dude. I tried that shit for like an hour straight and what? never got it. Or were you yeah. doing the method I was doing, like the bounce with the charge glide? Well, actually, no. I was just trying to bug up there, that's why I, you know, I was messing Yeah, up. it's it's a lot less consistent just trying to charge up there for some reason. Saboom just showing the game, you never say no to Saboom. Yeah, I get my way. Ooh, I, do, I, I don't know where this is, to be honest. So long as my dragon is purple and my president is orange, I get my way. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm gonna sound like a supporter of him. God. <laughs> That's racist. <laughs> That's racist. <laughs> oh, ladies and gentlemen, right. SSBM stuff. <laughs> just thinking day. of like another color association, and that was the one I got first. Rip me. You'll see the Trump 2020 signs on my stream soon enough, surely. Oh, God, no. <laughs> I don't know where the fuck this gem is. This is bullshit. What Chris is going through right now is like the same thing that like every spiral runner has to go through at like some point. Where it's like- Dread and spot. misery? Yeah, just dread and misery. <laughs> <Pretty much. laughs> Oh, That's no. exactly how this feels. Um, imagine this, but in a level that is about ten times as large. That's a TTD. Imagine this, but now imagine that oh, you're by dude. yourself in your room and no one's watching your stream. Yeah. <laughs> uh, uh. I don't. I don't know. Yeah, no, for real though. Like flashbacks to missing gems and ETD. That shit is like super bad. It's. Uh... I don't want to experience this pain. That was a very disdainful noise, Wally. <laughs> it's well practiced. Oh, He's turning into a Nork, guys. Ow. Um. Ow. <laughs> like wizard have a. Ow. Wow, wow, wow. 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 Yes. Chris. Chris. Ow. <laughs> I, I've checked like everywhere. Maybe it's uh... a. <laughs> I don't know, maybe it's up there? For five, you know? five dollars a month, you can help us want to press NPC. <laughs> this is so sad. Oh my god, play Despacito. <laughs> Remove hey, yourself from my vicinity. <laughs> it, it was, it was free gems, but Chris knew where one of them was. I'm legitimately confused. Where the fuck is this? So he found one, and he's still looking for another? They were in different mm. spots. Yeah. Well, this one of them, weird. I don't know which one it was, but this... I don't, I don't know what to say. Is it a green or, a, or potentially two reds? Guy? No, it's not this guy. Probably a green. It's a green, I just see him. Is it a turkey? Oh, I bet oh, you. Oh, is it lofty? Turkey. It's yeah. a Damn. fucking shit. <laughs> there he is. Oh, we, Fuck we the turkeys, dude. 
By the way, cool. happy Thanksgiving to everybody. I hope you all <laughs> eat a lot of turkey and kill happy them all. Thanksgiving. Please crash my game. Me what? Meanwhile, on Saboon stream, he's just nailing all of these barrel things. Yeah, this end part to North Cove is particularly difficult to. Get and right. he has the firework. Yeah. Oh, yeah, he got the the boys. clutch firework. Enemy destroying his own firework. The boom is pausing the game. <laughs> Hell yeah. <laughs> that was beautiful. That's an optimal pause. Just wanted to be sure. Friendly reminder: Inspire two to pause during the. Yes, please. I can't be the only one <laughs> on the team smart and wise. <laughs> All right, Saboom, so one death abuse or two? Um, hopefully zero, but we'll see. Zero. Or, sorry, uh, never mind, I guess <laughs> one is the minimum. <laughs> I was thinking if you get the proxy, you don't have to do it at all. Uh, it's still good. Um, so pretty much no matter what, I think it's going to be one. Oh, nice. Sorry Barely for spoilers. Oh, what? Yeah, that I feel like that should have worked, dude. <laughs> yeah, that really should have worked. Um, yeah, thanks, game. <laughs> uh, I promise I'm not gonna spoil for credits, Skip, though. Thanks, Todd Howard, for this gotta great stop, game. like, reacting to things. <laughs> Besides, the Fine Bros copyrighted reacting to things, I thought. The Spyro Reaction Trilogy. That's okay, because I have My no reaction. My grandparents react to Spyro the Dragon. <laughs> I remember watching my grandson play this. Children react to other people's childhood. <laughs> I bet that's an actual thing, too. Isn't that some BuzzFeed shit? Like, teens react to random shit? Yeah. Insert here. Silly shit. Oh, you gotta be shitting me, dude. I'm seeing this boom, and I'm also seeing the recovery. What the heck?! I thought it would have had like plenty of height and everything. Like, was that even possible right there? It uh, looked like. Dude, the boom is always pulling a fast one on us, man. Uh, always shit. introducing some uh, legendary yeah. stuff. Oh, is that a game over? No. Okay. Um. Boom, sort of getting a bit lost. Just get lost for another like six minutes, and I'll catch up. All right. All right. We, we can Just don't tell that. the viewers that it's, uh, you know, rigged yeah. or staged or whatever. Yeah, Saboon, just follow the script. Did I...? No, just, just read what's on the t-shirt, okay? Okay. Follow the teleprompter. What is on my t-shirt? Premium! That's what it's Premium? <laughs> Mine's a Zigboo, actually. <laughs> oh, baby. And like so right boom, now? Yeah, that super Wait, charge. what was that supercharge, dude? What the heck was that? Boom. Dude, I had to show that off because everybody else who tried so far in this marathon did not get it, and it didn't even look like they knew what they were doing. <laughs> you just have to time the charge. It's all about just like, well, you get a you jump off the top, you get a charge guy, and then it's just about timing the charge. That's crazy, bro. So, yeah. Sorry, Sabine. It's okay. Forgive me, guys. Yeah. Alright. Alright, we got both of these guys in Nasty's world now. Saboom is coming up on Nasty Nork right now, but if he misses credit skip like 10 times, this could still be a race. <laughs> <Maybe>. <laughs> I basically simulated missing credit skip about 5 times, so, you know. Oh yeah, big RIP to the beautiful Doritos guns in Reignited. The community just wanted their Doritos, and they couldn't have them. Damn. Whoa, what did they shoot now? They <laughs> shoot their Splatoon guns, bro. Literally what? Splatoon. I didn't yeah, know this. Purple paint. It's like, bro, Reggie, get the heck out of here, bro. This is my game. <laughs> Freaking shit, Gary Miyamoto. Get the heck out of my sight. Frick, we, man. We don't need an Nintendo propaganda. 
the Nintendo propaganda. Helps. There's always a chance. There is no chance. Thanks, Wally. I'm glad wait. You oh, whoa, what? Wait. Oh. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> what? <laughs> yeah. I think you're talking about different things there. There's always a chance for Doritos. Uh, yeah. It's <laughs> <laughs> always the chance that I go to 7-Eleven. <laughs> yeah. I'm still eating these taquitos right now, guys. Like, this, is, this has oh, been the man. best race ever, I just want to say. Hell yeah. It's healthy for me. Uh, uh, I disagree. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm sorry for Chris, dude. Yeah, not Chris's proudest race ever. Check us around. You'll find that he's had, on, on races. Yeah, he's had quite a few better races, I'm sure. Alright, Saboon coming up to the big boy, Nasty Nork. Let's see how we put this man. Oh, he's dodged the attack. Oh, he's taking damage. Oh no, is he gonna die? Wait, what? Uh, oh, we close. Yeah, didn't, close. didn't quite see. turn enough, unfortunately. So there's game. one miscredit skip. Chris, Ooh. you got this, bro. You're still in the game, bro. <laughs> What's the timer at right now? Something. Uh, One twenty-four. Twenty-four something. something. One twenty-four and oh, a half. Okay. All right. All right. It's not too bad. I was getting all worried. Right, I thought right, neither right, of us right. would be hitting that estimate, but I think we probably we might. <laughs> <laughs> well, you you got Certainly like got a like low fifty-six <laughs> beast makers, so you were on plenty. Oh of yeah. Time. Yeah, that's pretty sick. Of the boom having to take another lap around the track. Yeah, the walk of shame. Gives the boom shame. It will give him power. You can take advantage of this time to really admire Nasty's beautiful pectoral muscles. Yeah, he's yeah, he goals. He's he bought gold. <laughs> Hashtag don't skip leg day. But every time leg day happened, he would just go to McDonald's. <laughs> there we go, Spoon going for the same strategy. He's he's gonna take the damage. Got a, got a small balance, we got this. Oh, uh, what? He pushed me out of the corner. Just... Oh, I saw that, Chris. That was BM. That was BM. Oh. Bad manner. Uh, oh, another dude. miss. Oh, this is actually getting really heated right now. Oh, God. Dude, the, both those were so close, too. It's such a shame. Oh, man. They were so close. <laughs> so does that like, SPM. Black ass, like, tries at it. So I had a. Uh, it's just. It's hard, man. Rough life. Feels rough, man. But what did I tell everybody at the beginning of this run? These guys could be light years apart, but if someone starts messing up credit skip, then that's it. You know, like, let's go, you know. It's the boom on that walk of shame. Once more. I mean, we're all rooting for our boy Saboom. I know I am, but I'm also rooting for this race. I'm rooting for Doritos. Chicken nugs over here. I'm on team as chicken nugs. But you know what? I'm gonna leave Doritos and I'm gonna move on to Pringles. Pringles are good. Trader. That's not a bad call. They should shoot Pringles instead. Pringles. <laughs> Alright, there we go, boom. Let's go. What? Uh, this is a boom. Picking up <laughs> Chris that. is like, what? I was counting on a couple more fails. Boom, <laughs> picking up the third try. Yes, sir. He just needed the right bounce. So, yeah, now Saboom only has 20 gems and a dragon left, yeah? Yeah, That's according it. to the old guy at the beginning of the game. Yeah, 12,000 gems. But wait a minute. Wait, wait there's what? this dragon head that's right here that I never saw before. Let's check green, it out. The, the green dragon head. Wait, what? What is this? Nasty loot. Uh, Saboom. Dude, yeah, I'm, I'm busting out all the new freaking... <laughs> All the new stuff. Both about the new level. No, nobody, yeah, never before seen freaking <laughs> DLC for the originals. They came out with it when they did Reignited. 
So as you can see, Saboom is now in the final level, the bonus level, Massey Saboom, and he has the app. $60 for this DLC, unfortunately. Yeah. So, if you're not rich, you can't be good at this game. Yeah, Ooh, almost. Paid away. almost. But one thing, you, but one thing you can definitely see right now is that in Massey's loot, you can fly. Wait, you can fly? Dreams yeah. do come true, man. <laughs> I can fly. I believe I can fly. You can fly in this level. You can fly, but only a certain amount. We don't want it to get out of hand. Yeah. yeah. The sky ain't quite the limit, or actually, it is. Sky is the limit. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> the the door you open is your limit. However, if you really Ooh, want to it's good. But I guess... Okay. You know, it's a great metaphor for life, you know, you can only as fly, fly as high as, uh, you know, people say you can, until you show them up and go even higher. Hey, shit, dude, that's some be beautiful, like, poetic shit right there, Thank man. You. I wrote oh, that yeah. <laughs> Damn, man, it's wholesome, A-F. <laughs> Wisdom from Nostra Dale, man. And Saboom is about to pick up a whole bunch of gems. Yeah. Oh, oh my god. god. So 25, many. 25, 25, 25, 25, 25, 25, 25, 25, 25, 25, 25, 25, 25, 25, 25, 25, 25, 25, 25, 25, 25, 25, 25, Something. Uh, it was, that was like pretty much 1.30 on the dot. Yeah. Oh. Or, or just beyond that. Oh, I'm looking at the stream right now. Oh, yeah, 1.30, oh. 14 for you. Hold up, we got Chris going for Chris. Get bad, he's nailed it. He did? GG, Chris. Nice. Chris has nailed it. Woo! Uh, first try? Yeah, I am gone. Every time. Every time. This guy. That, yeah, that makes up for everything that went wrong in Lofty. That. Yeah, <laughs> easily, right? I'm just suddenly gonna be like sucked back into like Twilight Harbor. <laughs> <laughs> Break the space time continuum. So, dude, I'm curious though if that was timed like from start game or whatever, then I might have subbed the 130. Yeah, I think you did. Yeah. I think you did. Cause how many seconds is it when we do the racing timing? Or did no it's 22 seconds. Yeah, yeah so that's just about dude, like. I that. don't even care. Don't even work the numbers. Just tell me I subbed the 130 and I'll be you happy. You did it, bro. <laughs> yes! So Where are my chicken nuggets at? Hold on. All right. SSB and stuff. Nuggets. I You're can officially them. tell you, you subbed 130. Oh, great guys. You've done what no man just has kidding. done. Just kidding. You got the 130 OO. No. Don't tell me that. Yeah, big ups to everybody who freaking just everybody, dude. Dale, Wally for on the commentary, Chris and me having this awesome race. Everybody who's watching, Faulty and Phoenix and all those guys. I don't know who all is responsible for putting this thing together. I'm sure Wally has done a fair bit too. And Jake, uh, I know he was who was doing uh, some of the like, Whoa, yeah, like, like the art. I don't know. know. Aren't you like a part of like the organization? No, he didn't. I don't know. <laughs> no, well, he, he's holding down commentary on like every other goddamn run. <laughs> Give it up for this man. Shout out to Wally. Everybody yeah, is a beautiful individual, and there are billions of people on the planet, and not a single <laughs> one is the same as the other. You know what? We're all freaking beautiful. I'm about to and... start crying. Dude, <laughs> I'm a so one is yes, Wally one. <laughs> so emotional right now. Oh, yeah, dude. Really big shout outs to Boom and Chris and everyone who, who he mentioned. And especially shout out to who helped uh, yeah. make this, uh, this marathon come together. Big shout outs to them. <laughs> but Phenomenal. mostly shout outs to the viewers. No, oh, dude, I thought you were going to say mostly shout outs to 7 Eleven. <laughs> oh, well, dude. Shout out to 7-Eleven for getting me through this, bro. Like, I'm literally still <laughs> chilling on my last taquito right now. Download the 7-Eleven app. Coming to a phone near you. Who took what? Dea was drunk on nuggets. 
So <laughs> Bloomish Drunk on Hype. Yes. <laughs> Accurate. I'm drunk on whatever they're drunk on because I seem to resonate being drunk. Right? Isn't that <laughs> like I, I've kind of found the same thing before. You can sort of like just match yeah, that Chris. feel of yeah. the people you're hanging with. Like if you <laughs> Yeah. It's interesting. That's a new it that's been Chris coming in. Not it up. Guys, that was a really cool race. Like, um, for sure, GG. Kind of crazy at the end, but it was still a real pleasure to watch and to hang out with all the really cool people in the community here. So, I just want to say I love all you guys and shout love out to too, Spyro. Bro. Shout out to Spyro. Except for Reignited, that game's trash. No, I'm just playing. <laughs> Spyro fun hype. Yeet. Yeet.